The quick step, the fox trot. Didi Emafile is one of Nigeria's budding modern artists. Her exhibition in Abuja is called Unmatched Beauty. The paintings include diverse themes and not stereotypical images from Africa. In this painting, Didi depicts revelation, temptation, and creation in the Garden of Eden. In this series of works she calls Still They Rise, Didi focuses on the strength and resilience of women. And these paintings don't come cheap. They have sold for as much as $10,000 each. Right now, African arts is flourishing globally. Yeah, um, if one has been following the art scene a lot, a lot has changed drastically. You know, um, last year, Angola was the first African country to get the Lions Award at the Venice Biennale. A lot of people at that initially were collecting African art just for fun, just to have something hanging on their wall. But right now, there's a lot of value attached to it that some of them won't even sell it. No. Sales of Ndidi's paintings also show there's a growing demand for modern art from Africa. Last year, a piece from neighboring Ghana sold for $850,000, and sales of South African art have increased by 500%, according to Strauss & Co., an auction house in Johannesburg. And the idea that traditional African artifacts represent all that African artists have to offer is changing. Here at Abuja's art market, artists say there's been a decline in sales of traditional African art, like masks, textiles and sculptures, and that shoppers are now going for more modern pieces. At the apart gallery nearby, art dealer Hussein Akar says the increase in sales is because of the fact Nigeria and West Africa are now more accessible. Nigerian art, African art in general, has been underpriced. It, you know, it really, it's, it's amazing some of the pieces um, I've been in the business here for 15 years. Some, it's amazing the prices we used to sell for some, some top-notch art uh, 15 years ago as compared to the prices now. This is why um, it's a great time to be collecting as an investment, if you want, to be collecting Niger African art in general. That's good news for artists like Ndidi. She'll be taking her exhibition to London next month, where she hopes to find new buyers. Ivan Dege, Al Jazeera, Abuja, Nigeria.